I'm sorry, Mr. Grassle. Call me Ben, Mr. Grassle. Perhaps if we had done business earlier, I could have worked out a better deal for your land. But $25,000 for my farm? That's not even a twentieth of what it's worth. Well, you should have sold before we went to eminent domain. I never wanted to sell the farm. Well, now you have no choice. My family has owned that land for over 150 years. Our blood and sweat is in that soil. There's nothing I can do, Mr. Grassley. Now you have till the 30th to vacate the premises, and then we start construction on the shopping center. But where am I supposed to go? That's not my concern. Now if you'll excuse me. What if I left it to you? What's that? The farm, the land. What if I left it all to you? I don't understand. I'll make a will and leave you everything, Mr. Moore. Mr. Grassle, really? It belongs to you, Mr. Moore. Oh, excuse me. What was that all about, lad? I don't really know. Well, wasn't it that old coot from that farm? Yeah. And I think he's given us the property. Giving it to us? Are you kidding me? Plenty for a penny's gonna get that land for nothing? I think so. <laughs> the boss is gonna love you. Having no living family member, I leave this farm and the land it stands upon to Mr. Leonard Moore of Providence Construction. The only stipulation being that he honors the land as I did, as my father did, and as his father did before him. I do this of my own free will. Benjamin Grassley.
what the lawyers want. Remember that old timer from the farm? Yeah. He killed himself. What? That's terrible. Not really. The lawyer showed me a copy of his will. The old guy named me his sole beneficiary. I get his house and his land. Man, that's, that's sick is what that is. He's trying to make you feel guilty. I don't feel anything. What if I told you about succeeding in this business, Ted? As long as you can leave your emotions out of it and you don't get too attached to people, you can make as much money as you want. That's right. And I'm going to work a better deal for that land, and I'm going to clear a million bucks without breaking a sweat. Sure is peaceful. Well, I'll change soon enough. You could do with a wardrobe makeover. You are one ugly mother. <laughs> Damn it. This is a $1,600 suit. That's better. clean up after they got rid of the body. <sighs> Hire cleaning crew to clean kitchen.
Should make some nice money selling this crap on eBay. Hello? Very funny. I'm not falling for your tricks! So this guy, Lenny Moore, inherits this place. Then he drives all the way up here and disappears? Yeah. I don't like it. There's something definitely wrong with this place. First a suicide, then a missing person, and now a potential homicide. Well, it is strange, I'll give you that. I think this may have punctured that tire, sir. Yeah, could be. And that's something else I don't like. What's that? That scarecrow. Look at it. It's creepy. I could swear the last time we were here it was different. I can't put my finger on it, but it's changed somehow. Thank you. 